What exactly happened after I started supplementing Patek's ginseng? Well, let's find out. Hey, what's up? Greg here, the founder of Your Inception. Welcome to my channel. If you want to learn top secrets about nootropics or supplements, then subscribe below to start your journey. Today, I want to share with you my experience with Panax Ginseng. Now, this is a very potent and popular herb that has been used in the traditional Chinese medicine for centuries. And today, I want to tell you what happened after I started supplementing this herb, uh, what was my experience, what kind of dosage I took, and at the end of the video, I'm going to tell you if I recommend it or not. So if you're ready, let's just begin. Now, first of all, Panic Ginseng can provide lots of benefits. The biggest reason why I personally started supplementing it is because it can potentially improve your cognition and mood. And some people also report a better well-being and feeling much better after they supplement it. Actually, I found a study on healthy individuals. Um, they were giving about 200 milligrams of Panic Ginseng, a very potent uh, extract of that and after weeks of supplementing it, they felt more alert, their mood improved, and their overall cognitive performance improved as well. However, after about eight weeks of taking this compound, what happened in this particular study was that um, the benefits kind of went away or they were like less noticeable, but still the initial kick that they felt, the people felt, uh, was really impressive. And that what's got me into testing Panagensing as an individual compound. Now keep in mind, Panagensing contains uh, ginsenocytes, which is believed to be an active compound that is the reason why you get all those benefits. Now, if you want to learn more about other benefits, then click up here and you're going to find another video that I showed uh, just for you where I talk about benefits and so on. So when I started taking it, I really want to see if this compound makes me feel more mentally alert. And what I did is uh, I found different kind of extracts uh, on the market. Uh, that's one of them. I don't want to show you the brand because I don't want to promote it. But uh, just to give you an idea, this one contains uh, 300 milligrams of ginseng per capsule. Um, and the extract is 10 to 1. Um, so it's a pretty uh, potent extract, actually. Uh, I think it has about 20%. Uh, let me check it out. Yeah. Uh, it has about 20% of ginsenocytes, and some studies I found contain only 2 to 3% of ginsenocytes. So I think this is a very potent extract. Um, so I started taking about 200 to 400 milligrams of ginseng. Uh, in this particular case, that was 300 milligrams per day. Uh, I tried some other versions as well, and the dosage was a bit lower. And I took it before lunch or sometimes with lunch, um, sometimes even before or with breakfast, uh, just to see what happens. Um, and actually, I was quite surprised. By the way, guys, if you like this video, please press the like button below. So after a couple of days, I couldn't see any real benefits. I wasn't feeling much um, more focused or mentally alert or my mood didn't really change. But after about seven to 10 days approximately, um, I think something started changing. So yeah, it's a personal experience, but I felt more alert. At least that's what I thought. Um, and I was, you know, I was really under severe stress in this uh, period. Um, and, you know, when I was supplementing the ginseng, I didn't feel so stressed. I think I was able to focus much easier. And generally, I was in a much better mood. Now, if this is only because of ginseng or this is a placebo effect, it's kind of hard to judge. But according to studies, this is exactly what's supposed to happen. So I don't think that was placebo at all. Now, I even combined it with caffeine. And I don't know if you know about it, but ginseng can interact with caffeine. Um, I'm gonna make another video, guys, about that. So subscribe to this channel below, and as soon as the video is published, you're gonna find it up here. Now, I've been taking ginseng in different forms for a couple of months. Um, I took it as an individual compound. I combined it with some of my other uh, popular nootropics, such as Rudiola Rosam, the Copa Moneri. Um, by the way, if you wanna learn more about them, you can find the links up there, and or also in the description. Um, and yeah, after a couple of months of taking it, my general feedback is the following. I think my performance improved. I felt more alert. Um, I think I was a bit more productive because of that. And I was not that stressed as I was usually, you know, without taking this compound. Um, I didn't see like a major improvement or like a major increase uh, in my well being or something like that. But it was those subtle changes that really uh, kept me going. Um, um, and kind of convinced me that this, so ginseng, is very potent and very beneficial compound. One other thing I noticed is that I had fewer crashes. Now I wanna show you something. I have like a cheat sheet or like, yeah, 
I take notes like this um, every single day um, and I kind of write down everything that's going on in my life, um, like how I feel, how I slept. I have different trackers on my body, as you can see, aura ring and so on. Um, and basically, I always kind of a journal and, and try to report what's going on. And in the period when I was supplementing ginseng, I had fewer crashes. I'm talking about mental crashes. And this was really something that, that you know, got me thinking and kind of convinced me, yeah, this is a supplement. You should definitely try it out. So guys, the final question is, do I recommend panic ginseng or not? Well, according to my experience and according to studies, panic ginseng is a very potent and very effective compound that can be used for short-term um, boost of performance or also for long-term because of all the other benefits that this compound brings. And because of that, yeah, I definitely recommend trying it out. I think it's very useful. It might even become one of my favorite entropics, especially because you can easily combine it with some other compounds. Um, and because of that, I highly recommend trying it out. So that's it for this video. Thank you for watching, guys. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to contact me. Don't forget to follow your inception on Facebook, Instagram, and hope to see you soon again. Take care.